Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing a speed test on an iPhone 5. As you guys can see, on T-Mobile's iPhone friendly spectrum, which is launched in Las Vegas. Now it's not available everywhere yet, but I know it's available in Las Vegas because I have T-Mobile 3G. Now, I also did a couple of other speed tests that I took screenshots of when I have full bars and when I have not so many full bars. As you guys can see, I have about three bars right now and it's T-Mobile and it's on 3G. And let me take a screenshot of that. Sorry about that. And just so you guys can see it a little bit more clear, go to my photos. This is my screenshot. Going to zoom in in here. There you go, T-Mobile, 3G, three bars. So now that you guys saw that, let's go ahead and do a speed test. Now, I also updated a speed test on my iPhone 3GS in the same exact location as this phone right now. So you guys can compare it by the iPhone 3GS and iPhone 5 in the same exact location, which is my house. So let's go ahead and open up the app. And we're going to go ahead and begin the test right now. So, it's, it's actually pretty slow. It's doing like, okay, so for my download I got point, uh, 0 0.78 megabytes. And then for my upload... I'm only getting like 0 0.5, 0 0.6 megabytes. And that's like actually like the slowest that I've ever seen it. There you guys go. I don't know if you guys can get that or not. It says 0 0.78 and 0 0.05. Now, earlier today, I did a speed test on when I had full bars. Let's go ahead and zoom in. And this was at 351. And you guys can see T-Mobile 3G full bars. And then my speed was 8.84 megabytes for download over T-Mobile's 3G. And my upload was 2.07. And then I run the test again in another area where I only had four bars. And my download was 6.72. And my upload was... 1.20 and I also ran it when I, in an area that as you guys can see there is no 3G it's just T-Mobile Edge and my download was 0 0.18 and my upload was 0 0.10 so as you guys can see the 3G is actually a lot faster if you have good reception it could be as fast as 8.84 megabytes for downloading um, personally, I have like a, I don't have any problems like surfing the web or like uh, taking FaceTime calls or anything in that category, uploading pictures. So I think the speed is actually pretty fast for me, especially when I have good reception. I'm really looking forward to T-Mobile launching their LTE net, uh, network in 2013. And um, because this is an AT&T iPhone, it's going to receive that T-Mobile signal for the LTE. So there you guys go. This is the speed test of an iPhone 5 on T-Mobile's 3G network. And as of right now goes, it only just receives 3G. So there you guys go. If you have any questions, please go ahead and comment below. Thanks.